So you have tried 10 different passwords, but none of them is working. No matter how organized we as a person are, passwords are something that we all have hard time tracking. More than 70% of people reset their passwords within 90 days. Now password managing are on the growth and there are a lot of options to choose from. So today we will talk about the NordPass. We will cover all the pros, cons and everything you need to know about this service. Hey, what's up? My name is Shivam and before getting to the video, if you want to check out the NordPass for yourself, you can check out the first link down below in the description. And a huge thanks to NordPass for sponsoring this video. Now, NordPass is a service by Node Company, which is a well-known company for its Node VPN. And if you want to check out my review of the Node VPN, you can check out from the top right corner. Anyways, first of all, let's talk about the pros of the NordPass. NordPass is a very straightforward app. The interface is clean, simple, and everything is easy to understand. The app is available on all the major platforms like Android, iOS, Windows, Mac, Linux, Chrome, Edge, Firefox, Brave, etc. And it works flawlessly on all the platforms. When you log into the app, you are greeted with a very clean interface with minimal buttons. When you first install the app, you have two options. One is to add an item. Second is you can import your saved passwords from your browser. After you have imported those passwords, you have begun to build your node pass vault. From the sidebar of the app, you can filter out the items like logins, notes, etc. So it's quite easy to use the app. Now it is not just the passwords that you can store in here. You can also store your credit card or any other secure node notes in the app as well. The app on the smartphone also have OCR feature to scan the card and it will fill the data automatically. As mentioned, secure notes are also there which are simple notes that can store like addresses, ID number, bank information, etc. And I'm quite surprised that note a lot of password manager apps offer this functionality to save things other than passwords. From the security perspective, a great feature this app has is that it encrypts all the data locally, meaning all of your data will be encrypted. That is Converting our normal passwords to some random code before sending it to the node server so they would never know what information is stored the file can only be decrypted with the master password that you will set and by the way all of this is encrypted in x 20 encryption which is an excellent encryption to make things even more secure there is also an option for enabling two-step authentication you can enable this in the settings and after that you will get a qr code that you will have to scan from a mobile device with google authenticator or other two-step authentication apps another handy feature in the node pass is the personal form here you can store multiple forms and then in the browser we can choose which form to autofill in the website. Offline access is also there so the app on your device will also work even if you don't have an active internet connection. So those were all the pros of the NordPass and now let's talk about some of the cons. NordPass has some great features but there are also some downsides to this. So let's talk about that. Limited sharing. NordPass allows sharing passwords to others but the person should have to have a NordPass account to see the password. And that was the only con that I was able to find in the service. Now as far as we are talking about the price there are currently two plans for the premium it is $499 per month if you get the monthly plan but if you get the two-year plan it will cost you $2.49 per month the main difference between the two is with premium we get up to six active devices, secured item sharing, and trusted contacts. So if you want to get it for your family, then you can also pick up the family plan where you will get five accounts for $3.99 per month for the yearly plan. Now free plan is great to get started. And so if you feel the requirement, you can upgrade anytime. So if you want to get started, you can start by downloading the NodePass from the first link down below in the description. So that's been it guys, that was today's video. Hope you guys liked it. And if you did, just click the like button below. Share Share this video with your friends and subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. Until then, stay safe. Bye-bye.